The Orange County Sheriff's Office has been terminated after the Sheriff's Office says he abused his power during this traffic stop. The veteran officer is accused of holding a grudge against the man he'd been investigating for two years. Now Nine Investigates is getting the sergeant's side of the story from the appeals paperwork. Channel 9 Shannon Butler explains why the sergeant says the Sheriff's Office was out to get him. Keith Fiddler is a 30-year law enforcement veteran. Do not reach for that firearm. You hear me? An internal investigation into this traffic stop says that Vidler, though, purposely targeted Jeremy DeWitt, a registered sex offender who has a history of arrest for impersonating a police officer. Initially, Vidler said he was pulling the convicted felon over for carrying a firearm, but it turned out it was a pepper ball gun. The sheriff's office IA found that the pepper ball weapon was in plain view and not concealed and that DeWitt should have been released, but he was taken to jail. Vidler went in front of a board who would decide his fate. We tried to talk to Vidler last month about it. As far as commenting or anything, I can't because I'm not officially terminated. Now, when I'm officially terminated, then, then I can talk all day long. But until that point, I can't. He says he still can't talk today, but this paperwork obtained by Channel 9 tells us what Vidler told the board just a few days ago. He said he'd been investigating DeWitt since September of 2019, but in late 2020 was informed by his bosses that the investigation into DeWitt would have to be, quote, shut down, that they could take law enforcement action for violations in their presence, but no in-depth investigations would be permitted. He says there was no contact between him and DeWitt until the arrest of March of 2021. That, he says, shows he wasn't holding a grudge. In fact, he says he didn't know it was DeWitt at first. DeWitt had a pepper ball gun in a holster, and Vidler said he charged him with openly carrying a weapon. And even said he called a supervisor about their arrest, who told him, quote, good job. He says he knew this would be the outcome because he said he was outspoken on the investigation into DeWitt and about other things at the sheriff's office. But after days of taking the case into consideration, the recommendation was for termination. He has one more appeal left. We asked Orange County Sheriff John Mia to weigh in on Keith Vidler's termination. He said he couldn't do that because Vidler still has one more step in this process. As for Vidler himself, he says he too has to remain quiet until the case is over. In Orlando, Shannon Butler, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.